Yes. I think it swings probably between hurt and embarrassment. Um, you know, emotionally you get angry, you get frustrated. Uh, am I angry with players? Absolutely not. Uh, our players work as hard as anyone can ask of them. Um, they've been superb support staff out of this world, brilliant. Um, you know, they work endless hours planning, um, helping the boys. Um, so certainly we can't fault anyone within that change room. Yes, we didn't play our best cricket today. That's, uh, that's pretty obvious. Um, but yes, uh, you do get angry. I think the saying too many cooks probably uh, is accurate. Uh, Nick, uh, starting from the Champions Trophy, uh, you know, the one-off one madness. So uh, we are losing, losing, losing. But still, for our Sri Lanka, is a regular uh, full member nation. How? I mean, what is the deadline that you can give uh, to this kind of duty? Uh, yeah. You know, it's. I would like to answer that question because if it was up to me, and we had control over what we did, then you could you could probably give you a timeline. But I think it's a question you need to probably ask a few other people as well. Um, you know, for me, if we were left alone, and uh, you know, you could work with this group of players, um, and we could get some stability and consistency over a period of probably six months. You'd see massive improvements. These are seriously gifted players. They're very, very good players. So, you know, you give them a little bit of time, and you give them a little bit of love, uh, a little bit of care. You know, you build up that confidence. You'll see, you'll see results quick. Since the day you take it over, if we see continuous uh, players falling, falling down, continuous like they getting injured, so whatsoever, some sort of trouble. So, uh, how do you feel about this kind of situation? I mean, the players getting injured one after the other. I think if you look at around the world sports teams, at the, the percentage